scared the shit out of me. Had their guns run on this dude, and I was right in front of him, right here. Fucking scary shit, dude. What's this dude doing? Get the ever-loving shit on me. Oh, he's taking a ride. He's taking the ride. Uh oh. That was quick. Hey, that's the same cop that I sure after I came right next to us, he must have whipped right around. That was fucking nuts. <laughs> that was crazy. That yeah, was. At first, I thought he was calling you over. I thought I was. I was like, what? I'm getting pulled over. Yeah. I saw the. He drew the gun, and I was like, we out. I don't care, red light or not, I'll break the law. Not doing that. I'm not getting shot for somebody else. Right. Man, I'm almost shaking. I'm almost, literally almost shaking, dude. I scared the ever-loving piss out of me. I thought we were getting As soon as I saw the guns drawn, I was like, yo, what the fuck? Oh man, this guy's taking the ride. Poor guy. Wonder what he did. I'd say I'd FOIA request it, but you know, that's not like they're gonna fucking give it to me. They hate me, dude. Does he not know he does? He has a right to not answer questions. He is taking the ride. Just remember, bro, you don't have to answer questions. You have a right not to answer them. They're trying to help me. Okay, go cool. get some help if you need help, my dude. Can you stop taking I can't do that. That that I can't do, my man. It's for it's for your safety. Okay. Take a couple steps. No thanks. Yeah. Kick rocks. Tell me what to do. I'm on a public sidewalk, my man. Hello. Must be new here or something. <laughs> Take a step back. God, I'm still shaking a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Fucking little nigga! 
No, this motherfucker was just down there at the store across from the gas station, right? And he just fucking assaulted a woman. And not only that, but he pulled a fucking knife on me, him, and another guy. Yeah. And I just had to like, pull my concealed carry and fucking back. draw down We tried down to have him leave. This fucking he crackhead right here needs to be thrown in fucking And jail. we, like, got in between to stop him. And he went ahead and, like, we tried to have him. Right yes, it's, it's it? appendix period. Um, That's an illegal search. Yeah, That's an illegal search. It's no, there's no such thing as officer safety. Okay. Stop with that. Do that. There's no such thing as do something. Take a step back. Do something. Can you go that Put way, your please? Hands on me. Okay. Can you go that way, please? Can you go that way? I'm this is a public go this sidewalk. Way. Okay. This is a public yeah. sidewalk. Don't tell me what to do. This is an illegal search. We were on our way to the. You guys see this? This is illegal. I have his. I have his picture and Again, we were on our way to the citizen. police station. There's no reason to disarm, you, There's no reason to disarm this man. Yeah. That's illegal, yeah, man. I could have shown you my license. I ha I'm legal to carry now. You need to get at least 20 feet back. Right? You, need feet back. you need to shut the fuck up and leave me alone. Touch me again. You Touch me again. Do you know who the fuck I am? Trucking? You know who the fuck I am? I don't care who you are. You're gonna I don't care. Give a fuck who you are. Yeah, you're gonna care. When you lose your qualified immunity. Okay. You, what, you think I don't know? I'm too close. This is a sidewalk. Can you back up? This is a sidewalk. We're conducting a fucking This is a sidewalk. Can you back up? This is a sidewalk. Don't swear at me. I'm gonna file a report on you. You guys are fucking not coming at me, though. Guys, we were literally on our way to the police station to come to you guys to show I have this picture. Not only did you work for his license as well, and he took off. How so? literally attempted like to swing with a knife and he automatically what law is that i'd like to know too can you can you recite the law that allows you to disarm a legal citizen I did the right thing. Tell one of them to come down here. We got the people on the sidewalk. We were literally on our way to the police station. Getting in the way. Try to say I'm obstructing. Obstructing is a secondary crime, first off. You don't even know the law, and you're out here fucking disarming people, dude. You don't even know the law. You're disarming people. And when we were trying to have him stop, that's all you had to ask for. That's it. Like, you know, nobody touched him. Like, I'm more than happy to identify myself. Like, what should happen is this man should identify himself to you. That's what should happen. I know. That's right. Tell him. I know that he's violating. He is. And, and you know what? If you want this video, I got you, bro. I'll give you my uh, my site. It is, it's on. It's going on YouTube. It's going on YouTube. That one's PA. So hold on, man. There's New York. Would you like the list of all my firearms? Listen, you're you going to get it back. Yeah. There you go. We're not stealing it. Yeah. No, no, you, well, you, you technically you just stole it. You me, bro. You did steal it. You stole his firearm. You fucking just steal it from me. You're you stole it. Me. What if I took your gun? You would try to fucking draw down on me and shoot me. Yes, you would. Just like you just drew down on that man right behind me. There's no officer no, no, safety. Your safety is your safety is no concern. There's no such thing. Do you not understand how feeling unsafe works? There's no like such thing as officer you safety. So you what is that? The way that you were trained, if I pull a knife out and charge at you, what's your first instinct? Pull your gun. So Defend yourself. He is? Well, you just disarmed him. Is, like you literally taking out time right Bro. now. Oh, I'm what? staying here. You're not holding me. I'm more happy to stay. Why held down though? Like, I think that's what he just said. I know. He just said it. I got it on video. To do the right legal thing because I drove my firearm on somebody. Dude, I was like, we were, we're not stealing your gun. You just did. Uh, you did. What you just did is stealing. Uh, and now I don't know when I'm going to get it back. And again, yeah, now there's more guns in. showing up. Now you You're guys got two speed troopers. the man. So wait, you need an interview? An interview? For what? I don't know, just because... because I want to know. Just because it doesn't involve me. You know, it does involve me. I'm a concerned you. citizen. It doesn't involve me. And you're a shitty cop. It doesn't involve me. <clears throat> I can't believe I just got that on video. This guy's going to sue the fuck out of you, dude. He's going to sue the shit out of you. There goes your, your house. 
your car, all that. Like, that's crazy. You can't just disarm somebody. Officer safety. That's not even a real thing. Look it up in his guidelines for the Binghamton Police Department and Broome County Sheriff's. There's no such thing as officer safety. I'm going to dismount my bike now that I'm disarmed anyway. That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, might as well pull it out and get it out of the way, right? That way they don't, you know. That way they don't shoot you. Don't want to, don't want to get shot on accident. It's fucking crazy, dude. Holy shit! That's this is crazy. This is like nuts. How dare you? Two C one three, State Trooper, New York. Yeah, I pulled over to talk to these guys because I had to draw my concealed carry on, on this guy. We were on our way to uh, the police station. I got this dude uh, license plate. With pulled a knife on on three people like, you know, and assaulted a female before yeah. that. Beforehand, anything happened, he assaulted a female. The other worker locked her car and the car beat. And this, this man went ahead and yeah, just the, the horn started horn. like screaming, oh, why the fuck would you beat the horn? That's too loud. That's fucking disrespectful. Started walking up on her. Oh. Yeah. And he literally just went ahead and like he sued it like after she walked into the fucking store. And he tried to go ahead and go after her. Okay. And the other worker now look, more and tried to stop him. He, yeah, he pulled the knife out once, so like, one, two of us, and the other guy, like, stepped in between, because he literally assaulted a woman, and we're like, what the fuck? Then he put his hands on her? He basically, like, shoved her to a whole plank that's right there, and she hit the wall, and basically fell over. So you two of were just there, right? We, we were walking you don't out know the store. Yeah, no Nick Miller, which one? And there's multiple witnesses down there. Tall. Yeah. 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 Daddy? Yeah. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> don't do that. She works there. She was grabbing something out of her vehicle and she locked her car in the horn. Yo, why are you swearing? This man stays straight saying f bombs. Who is he? No, you guys went about it that we stole his gun. That's how you guys got you guys wanted to continue to yell and serve the whole property. I was not yelling. So you didn't? You're saying you didn't steal his gun off him? I didn't record you stealing his gun off him? Is that what you're saying? Who are you anyway? What's your name? And why aren't you guys arresting this man for assaulting me? Yeah, that's funny, isn't it? You stupid fuck. You think that's funny? You think assaulting citizens is funny? And again, I, I pulled over. Yeah. I, I got you on video, bro. I was gonna come down the road just to, to get Your day of reckoning is coming, apparently. Because if you, you treat me like that, you can only imagine what he treats other people like.
This guy right here. This guy right there. We're gonna get him. We're gonna find out who he is. Put your hands on me. Officer safety. Here we go. Cops playing again. Officer safety. It's always. What about our safety? Yeah. What about our safety? We gotta be disarmed? That's some bullshit. That's crazy. That's right. That's right. Okay. So I, I have absolutely no clue what's going on with the officer before I got here, right? I have no clue that conversation until, but for you and me right now, all, all I know is we're having a conversation, right? Well, it sounds like, to me, if everything checks out, we can have a conversation. There's going to have to wear, right? Yeah, I, I guess. Where's the match? Is it softball or? There it is. Softball. Everybody says it's softball or soccer. That's a good guess. Bounce houses. Okay. Yeah. Are you letting well, it good? Can you get in there and do the opposite uh, courses and stuff? Uh, yep. I was saying, I'd follow the first two seconds. <laughs> we do too. <laughs> we do too. As long as we're on the same page, right? Yeah. <laughs> if you add water, we're just. Like, add water, it's over. <laughs> it's over. We're done. People like to add soap to them. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Stupid, but they do it. I, I, did, I was at this redneck <laughs> wedding and they had a, like, a bouncing house relay yep. thing that they did there. Can't complain, it was a lot of fun. Fun, fun, fun. Are you guys taking this? I have no clue. Um, there's two, there should be two suits back there. I passed on the way. Wilcox is back. So, did you talk to them to see if they'd make contact with them? So I called over when I got there and said there was nobody left in the parking lot. So I had not made contact with them. Ask them if they made any contact. I think this video is going to be a banger. It's going to be a good one. I guess it's going to be a good one. Fucking. Put your hands on me. Nothing good. Who the fuck? You saw that, right? You saw him put his hands on me. Yeah, he basically was shoving you with his arm. It's like none of you guys are gonna fucking do anything about this guy assaulting me, right? This fucking dweeb right here in the sunglasses who thinks he's fucking tough, who assaulted me. None of you guys are gonna do anything, right? Who is he? What's his fucking name? I want to know. What is that that man's name right there? I want to know that man's name. Any guys gonna tell me? Nobody. Nobody. It's great. Fucking dweeb. Think you can just assault the fucking public? That's real nice of you, man. That just shows what you really like out there in the field, doesn't it? Is that how you treat your wife? Put your fucking hands on her too? Push her around? Kick your dog? Fucking piece of shit, dude. You don't put your hands on people. You don't push people. You keep your hands to yourself. They taught you that in grade school, my dude. Fuck. Grade school shit. Grade school. Keep your hands to yourself. This video is definitely going to be a banger. I guarantee you this guy right here is going to lose his fucking job. I guarantee you that this man right here is going to lose his job. Guarantee you. When the people on the internet and my buddies see this, he's going to lose his fucking job. The calls are going to come in and you're going to be done, man. You don't put your hands on the public. You don't do that. You should know better. You're trained. You're laughing and giggling because it's fucking funny. You won't. You already touched me. What do you mean you won't touch me? You already did. You pushed me. You straight pushed me. Did you see that? You saw that, right? Okay. And my camera saw it. Yeah. And my camera saw it too. I got your whole face and your arm pushing me. Yeah, dude. Who the fuck are you? What's your name and badge number? Who are you? Yeah, walk away, cause you know, the walk of shame, right? That's what it is. So not one of you guys is gonna tell me that man's name, that officer's name, who are you? What's your name and badge number? Deputy Burr, 603, thank you. You're the only professional one here, so far. I bet she's professional though. She's really nice. But this guy right here assaulting me on a public sidewalk?
for filming in public? Come on now. Who is he? What's his name? Somebody better tell me his name, because if I have to go down to the station and find out. Sorry to do that to you, man. That's really fucked up, but I'm glad I got that on video. Nah, man, you were fine. I, exactly what you explained seemed perfect. That guy pulled a fucking knife on you. You waited till the last second. You drew your gun. You didn't fire at him. That was, you know, fair. Yeah, dude. Then he just had it. Right? They even admitted the fact that, you know, if the same thing happened, vice versa, while they're okay, yes, yeah. that man would have been dead. I'm that man would have been right dead. So, That's right. Yeah, I mean, you pull a gun or a knife on somebody, that man be dead. Especially a cop. Oh, that one, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's always there. I see him coming up and down Burr. Yeah, we won't record that. We'll clip that out. It's a it's a protected right. I mean, that's absolutely ridiculous that they would disarm you. All they had to do was ask for your papers. That's it. And honestly, they didn't even have to do that really because you didn't commit a crime. You didn't commit a crime. You didn't do anything. That's it. Yeah. I mean, at least you pulled over to talk to him and be like, hey, this is what happened, you know what I mean? You could have just left. It's fucking ridiculous. These cops in this area are absolutely ridiculous. She's, dude, that's, I only... Yeah, only one guy identified himself. The other guys don't want to say nothing. Say, most of the state troopers are definitely... They're, they're better to deal with. Yes, I agree. The sheriffs are just bad news. If you guys want to meet me back in the station, do that, or I'd like to just do it now. Yeah, so 84 Crescent. So once we figure this out, that's where we're heading. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, What's that? I think it's Spanish. Probably is. Do you hear him? Listen to this guy. Here we go with the cops landing. They just literally don't care about our rights whatsoever. 
No, they, they're going to give him his gun back, but they just don't give a fuck about our rights and they just want to cops playing and waste time. Oh, it's for our safety. It's for our safety. This guy right here is a fucking piece of work. Oh yeah, guaranteed. Oh yeah, they would have shot his ass. Oh yeah, they would shot him. Oh yeah. They would have, off duty, on duty, it don't matter. It's your life over theirs. Ah, the man was swinging a fucking old knife. I'm saying the motherfucker had a knife. Hey, he had a knife. Down here, this one right here, like right yeah, here. Yeah. Nah, the one uh, right there down the street, like high standards and whatever. Oh, we're talking about the snow cone. Yep. Wow. Like right across from me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The snow cone and high standards is right there. Yeah, yeah. I used to live right over there. Oh yeah. And we literally like fought behind them just because we see they pulled him over. Just so we were, like I said, we were on the way to the fucking police station, right? But once, once we see that already got to me, that we were about to report, we were like, you know, might as well stop and tell our spot. Like, instead of you waiting for me to get to the goddamn station, so you know what exactly happened. It's Sapanic, 779. Caleb J. Sapanic? Yeah. Alright, cool, 779. Thanks, boss. Took you long enough. Be more polite and nicer to people. It's your job. Yeah. Don't okay me. What else do I respond? You say, I'm sorry for putting my hands on you. That's what you say. If I put my hand on you, I would have called. You put your hands on me. People saw it. There's four witnesses here. All you had to do is say sorry. What's that? Could have just said sorry. Yeah, it's on, so it's fine.